Well, have you ever tried creating your own business and putting it to the test? Well, that's exactly what students at George McGovern Middle School are doing. Kellyland's Matt Holson takes you to McGovern's Market. From goods to services, eighth graders are putting their business plans into practice. So we are selling products here to other students. We've been working on our business plans for a while. So we're here selling uh, what we've made, what we've come up with. Carter Benson's group is targeting fellow classmates' cravings for snacks by selling popcorn, donuts, and Kool-Aid. I think it's junk food, so middle students are going to love it. <laughs> McGovern's Market is the culmination of a program led by the national organization Youth Entrepreneurs. Youth Entrepreneurs loans the students the money for their projects. The kids have to pay it all back, and anything they make over that amount, they get to keep. My group is called Drip Gloss 2.0, where we sell hair products, lip products, like lip glosses, scrunchies, hair clips, as you can see, all over my hair. Khadija Kada says the program has been a lot of fun. Fun, but challenging at the same time when it comes to working with others. <sighs> oh, it is hard because some, you know, everyone always has different ideas, so it's hard to like incorporate everyone's ideas into one. So it just makes it really stressful. While it's taking Drip Gloss 2.0 a little while to repay their loan, RM Cuisine is battling a supply issue. I made um, Filipino egg rolls, and my partner made Japanese roll cakes. The egg rolls and cakes were such a hit they sold out in 10 minutes. It makes me happy that I can bring in my culture into something like this, and I hope my partner feels the same way. We put, we both put in a lot of effort into it. And it paid off. Their loan was $50, and they brought in 64. Creating a business is something Michelin Jinchu never thought about, but now she's into it. It's been really fun. I, I actually, that's probably one of the classes I really look forward to. In Sioux Falls, Matt Holson, Kelloland News. Food is always a good idea. A lesson in business. Yeah, yes. I like it.